Hey guys, for today's 90 second challenge, I'm gonna be designing a new fruit. 90 second challenge! All right, Gabriel, you've got 90 seconds to think into existence, a new type of fruit. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, three, two, one, go. Okay, so I'm thinking a medium sized fruit, maybe, mm -hmm. maybe a small melon, sort of. Um, so we're the size of a small melon. Yep. Can't be spiky because I don't want people to think, wow, it's spiky. I don't want my kids to like, <laughs> like scratch up their throat on this. <laughs> so let's, we're gonna make it smooth. Smooth, smooth melon sized fruit. Yeah. So um, we're gonna have it. I don't really, I don't think a lot of people like dry fruits in particular, mm. but I'm a more juicy guy. Mm. So I'm gonna make it really juicy. Gonna have all the water, kind of like a watermelon, but sweeter. So far, I think you've created a watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> it's watermelon sized and sweet kind of, and like kind of, But it's like, and not mango flavored, but it's like as sweet as a mango. Okay. And what color would this fruit be? This color would be purple. Mm. Fruit would be purple. Um, Describe the taste of such a fruit. Um, tastes uh, a little sour, but not. That and that much, not noticeable. Um, uh, Where would this fruit naturally grow? Uh, let's see. Uh, it would only be cultivated in my backyard. Okay. That's where it would be called. And lastly, what would this fruit be called? This fruit would be called. Uh, let's see. Hurry! Uh, uh, the, uh, <laughs> like, I don't know. Uh, all right, time's up. So we've come to the conclusion of a medium-sized fruit the size of a small melon that's very juicy and smooth, a little sour, and can only be found in Gabe's backyard. Help the, uh... <laughs> All right, everyone, thumbs up if you think that's a 90-second challenge success. Thumbs down if it's a failure. <laughs>